What up, heathens? Um, this week's question is all about age restrictions, and it comes in two parts. I believe that the problem we have with age limits is that we uh, don't think about them enough, or don't teach about them enough. Maybe that's where we're going wrong. We just kind of set the age limit, and that's it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. And um, that doesn't work, really. If you simply tell someone not to do something, uh, it actually makes them want to do it a little bit more, it adds that allure to it. And that's why so many kids have that kind of fascination with alcohol prior to the uh, legal drinking age. It's the forbidden substance that they must have. And um, so what we really need to do is to educate people in regards to why the age limit is there. Um, for instance, alcohol. It's a bad idea to consume alcohol at a young age. Your body's really not up to it and it can cause a lot of damage. Um, of course it can cause damage no matter what age you are, but while you're still developing your body, um, it's a particularly bad idea. And I suppose the same goes for uh, sex as well. We need to teach children that, you know what, you probably don't want to be engaging in sexual activity until you fully understand what it is <laughs> and um, you know what could possibly happen from engaging in sexual activity. We have a ridiculously high teenage pregnancy rate here in the UK. I think it's because our uh, sexual education is uh, piss poor, to say the least. Um, and I, I, th I think that's what it is. I think we don't necessarily need laws, you know, banning something before a certain age. Um, if we actually got off our asses and bothered to teach people why it is that they shouldn't engage in certain activities um, until they fully understand, you know, what it is or um, their bodies are capable of, say, the consumption of alcohol. The second part of the question is about how um, age limits are kind of spread out over a certain amount of time, usually the kind of later stage of your teenage years. Um, in the UK it kind of begins here at 16 in which you're allowed to have, have sex and um, you used to be allowed to start smoking at 16 when I was a youngin but uh, now I think they've boosted that up to 18 as well and everything pretty much ends at 18 by that point you're allowed to do anything that is deemed legal by society um, again maybe it's something that kind of makes sense I just don't see the uh, point in having laws restricting it um, yeah, maybe you should learn to drive before you are legally allowed to start consuming alcohol. Like, that kind of makes sense to me. But there are other cases in which I think it is completely the wrong way around. For instance, you can't vote until you're 18 here in the UK. Uh, but you can sign up for um, military training at the age of 16, as long as you have a parent's consent. Um, although they don't send you into kind of like a war zone or anything like that until you are 18, I find it kind of ridiculous that, you know, you can have your country stick a gun in your hand and train you to be one of its, uh, you know, killers. Um, but you can't have any say in the leadership of that country at that stage. That seems kind of backwards to me. It's been said before in other people's videos to this question, but it, really it's all about maturity. And unfortunately, maturity isn't a set thing like age. Um, you know, someone by the age of 16 might be mature enough to consume alcohol in a, you know, reasonable, safe amount to uh, be able to drive a car without causing some massive pile up and all that. And maybe more than, you know, mature enough to vote and to take the process seriously. But someone else might not be. Um, so having these blanket kind of restrictions is a little bothering to me. I think it, it does need to be kind of judged on individual cases. Uh, of course the problem is then is how do we judge on individual cases? Um, does it come down to the parents? The government? Who does it? Uh, I don't know, I don't really have the answer to that, but, but I think that the way we're going about this all is a bit backwards right now. Um, yeah, another convoluted, probably nonsensical video by me.